All right, on my Instagram feed, I posted yesterday some new clubs I got. I got some new wedges, and I got this funny-looking club called uh, Wedge Wood, and it's a 7-iron, and um, it's by Wedgewood Golf. They have uh, these type of, it looks sort of like a wood, and sort of like a wedge, and sort of like a iron, and sort of like a hybrid, <laughs> it kind of combined. It's a kind of a thick material, but it's not heavy it's light anyway it's supposed to be you know game improvement super game improvement or whatever easy to hit so anyway i got it just to test out i want to try these i want to try this on some par threes and see if it's a little bit more easier to uh get to the green uh with it but um uh, that aside i'm not real fond of the grip that came on it it's not it's not terrible it's it's a it's a decent good grip it's not smooth or anything so you know it's not worn in other words i haven't played with it yet but i want to show you something um i use these uh, you see me buy the old clubs sometimes i post them on instagram and uh, and uh, uh i've gotten these temporarily uh so i can regrip it and uh, and use the club right away and then later on i'll get an actual grip and put it on if i like the club or I'll turn around so but anyway I'm gonna show you real quick how to put these on hopefully uh, you can see the some of the details I'm not gonna I'm gonna kind of go fast a little bit with with it with it maybe I don't know so <laughs> I got to let me open the package uh, I suggest using scissors but you know that's crazy people are dangerous you don't want to cut the grip but just take out the then there's instructions on the back um, but people have a little bit of struggle with it and it comes with these little stickers that say, um, alien pros. Anyway, uh, let me get these and I'll show you how that all goes on there. But, uh, it comes with a, it's got the little clear plastic cover over it. So I'm going to take that off real quick. If I can find it, there it is. All right. All right. Once you get out of the package, it'll have a little piece that covers the sticky part and you want to put that, take that off and you want to put this on uh, about a quarter of an inch below your uh, butt of your club. That's where I, that's where I put it. You can put it to the edge if you want, I guess. And then I just start turning my, my club and I wrap it just to blow the edge of the of the wrap right in here and keep going and hopefully you get a good smooth wrap now you I mean if you make a little mistake you can always go back and redo it it's not too difficult to to redo but so it takes a few times once you do this a few times you get it really easy and then you know exactly where to put it but anyway this is how I do it. Just turn it, keep turning it, and just make sure that I'm overlapping a little bit. And you want it tight. You don't want it. You don't want to stretch this too much, but it will stretch. So, so if you kind of run out, and I'm see, I've I've overlapped too much. Uh, not enough maybe, because I've got a lot of there left. But and let me go back because I'm going too far. Okay, now, there. and then you can, you could trim it off if you want to, you could trim, say you got too much and, or you don't, and you don't want it to be too thick at the end, you can cut that off. I just go ahead and use it up and it, it don't bother me. And then stick, there's another little piece of uh, plastic cover at the end, you stick that on there. Okay, once you've gone all the way around your grip with the with it, um, the wrap, you can get these little the little stickers that it came with, and uh, take the backing. It's got a backing off of it, and what I do is I just find my end where I stopped, and I kind of go all the way around. Now you can go all the way down here if you want. I just go all the way around the edge because I don't want no sticky sticking out, and go and match it. Okay. 
and then I, I'll cut that off. You use a pair of scissors because it, it look kind of jagged if you don't have a really sharp knife. Make sure you don't cut your finger. There you go. Now, got it on, on there. So that, that feels good. There's no bulges. And if, like I said, if you make a mistake, you can always um, unwrap it, rewrap it. I mean, they're, they're, they're not, uh, you know, they're pretty durable, I think. And, and it feels pretty good. It's kind of got a squishy, soft, tacky feel to it. And heck, you could you could play with that without a glove, I think. So that's how good these are. And uh, anyway, but there you go. So I just regripped that that grip that I didn't like. <laughs> and I mean, these come in all kinds of colors. So I want them to make plain. They're they're uh, I think they were thinking about doing it. They haven't yet. But plain colors like black, gray, white, if you want, orange, red, whatever. Just plain. But there you have it. That's how you do it.